Hey everyone, Cherie here. Today I wanted to share with you my days one and two of my 2019 December album. So what I'm working with on this spread is a large 6 by 8 inch photo. Uh, this one is Aiden putting the star on the tree. Each year the kids take turns on who gets to put the star on top and this year was Aiden's turn. I've also got a photo of Aiden and Madison. Riley was here as well however he didn't want to be in the photos this year which is totally fine. So these are my first two photos. So this card here I've created in Photoshop using the Felicity Jane Cozy Digital Kit. So what I did was created a 4 by 3 inch card and made the background red. Then I used the digital stamps to uh, add in this merry and bright phrase here. So I just changed the stamp to white and popped it in the middle and I love how that has turned out. For my journaling card, I've also used the Felicity Jane Cozy Digital Kit. Now at the top here I just added in the little uh, mistletoe element here. The original version actually has these really light grey berries but I really wanted red on this card so I just used a brush and added some little red dots over the top of that so that I had red on this card. And then across the bottom to finish it off I've just added these uh, red lines across there and I'm really happy with that. So that is my journaling card all done. So I've got some other Felicity Jane goodies here like the stamp set, I've got a chipboard number, a chipboard flare, I've got these tiny tags, I'm going to use this little red tag here. I've got my date stamp, some confetti stars, I always love to add gold stars to my album and I do have the December daily um, word stickers here, the word phrases. So I may use this Deck the Halls one as well. So I'm going to get into it and I'll pop you on fast forward, get this one done and then we'll look at day two. Okay so to start off with I'm just going to create this little embellishment cluster down the bottom right hand corner of that large photo. So I've got the Hello December chipboard flare from Felicity Jane just going on there now. I've also got the chipboard number and I've got some foam dots behind that because I'm overlapping it with that chipboard piece and I'm going to add that uh, Ali Edwards sticker over the top of that chipboard as well and I do have a little bit of foam tape on the far left side of that sticker since it is overlapping that chipboard. The only other thing I'm going to add here is a little gold confetti star just at the top of that circle there and that page is done. So now moving over to the cards I've got that merry and bright card I'm just going to add a date to that so I've just stamped that with my Felicity Jane date stamp so it says December 2019 with the two hearts in the middle and I'm just going to adhere that under where it says merry and bright so I will be adding a little bit of stitching to this shortly but to finish off this card otherwise I'm just going to add another one of those confetti stars at the top there so I just used a glue dot for that one all right, I'm leaving the journaling card just as it is. I don't think it needs anything else, keeping it simple. Uh, but I am going to add a couple of things to that other photo. So I've got that tiny tag from Felicity Jane and I've got a stamp from the Noel stamp set that says Ho Ho Ho, uh, which is appropriate because both the kids are wearing Santa hats in that photo. Well, Madison's wearing the guinea pig Santa hat, which is rather funny. I'm just going to trim that up now and add it to that tiny tag. So just using my scissors to trim that down to size. I'm going to adhere that to the tag using some double sided tape. I have already added my twine to the top of the tag as you can see. And now I'm just going to use my sewing machine to stitch across that and across that date stamp as well. So that's now done. I'm just adding a smaller confetti star to that tag just in keeping with the other stars across this spread and I'm attaching it to the photo using a red mini wide paper clip from Felicity Jane. I'm sticking that tag down onto the photo so that it doesn't float around inside the pocket and cover their faces. So that is day number one complete. So just giving you a closer look at those and then I can move on to day number two. So day two I'm working on the back of that pocket page. 
So just pulling that one out. And I do already have a few things chosen for this. So I've printed out my journaling in Photoshop and I've added a digital stamp from the Felicity Jane Cozy digital kit at the bottom. And that uh, green card there is from the Felicity Jane Noel kit. I'm using a cardstock star from the Noel kit as well and I've just added machine stitching around that across the bottom of the journaling card and around that green card as well. So for this star I'm going to add the word joy using these Felicity Jane gold stickers and I believe they were from the Harper kit. Absolutely love this font. One of my favorite alphabet stickers ever from Felicity Jane I think. Just fiddling with that J a little bit to get it looking right. Now I can go ahead and stick that one down onto that green card. So that is done. I'm going to work on the photo now. I've got that chipboard number from Felicity Jane and I'm going to add an, another Ellie Edwards um, sticker across that. So I'll grab that and I'll use a bit of foam tape under the left end of that sticker since it is going across that chipboard piece which has a little bit of dimension. So I'll stick that one down and then all I'll need on this is another one of those confetti stars. I always love adding those stars to my December album. You see them everywhere. It is actually gold. The lighting in the room makes it look a little dark, but it is a gold star. So for the top of my journaling card there, I'm going to add the word cozy from the Noel stamp set from Felicity Jane. So I've just got a scrap piece of cardstock. I'm going to use some Ranger embossing powder called Princess Gold, one of my favorites. I've got my Versamark ink pad there. So just going straight onto the cardstock, I'll sprinkle my embossing powder over the top and that's looking good. I'll just set it aside while I clean up. I do have the fan on in my room because it's so hot. So I just want to clean everything up so I don't get it everywhere. So that's done. I'm using my heat gun now to heat up that embossing powder and I love the result. Lovely and shiny gold. And now I'm just going to fussy cut that out using my scissors and add it to the top of that card. And I will grab this sewing machine and add a row of stitching across that as well just to add a little bit more texture to that. So that is now done. I can go ahead and add that to my pocket page and then into my album. So days three and four are already on my channel if you'd like to check those out. You can see that um, the tree to the right of day two is part of my day three video. So if you want to check that out, it's on my channel. So thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you've enjoyed seeing how I've put these days together and I'll be back very soon to share more pages from my December album. Thanks for joining me. Bye for now.